and some World War II veterans from our area who went to Normandy for the 80th anniversary of D-Day have returned to Palm Beach County where they were greeted by a roaring crowd. Steve King joins us live from Palm Beach International Airport with a look at the warm welcome home for these American heroes. Steve. Jade, well, hundreds of people gathered to greet two World War II veterans who returned here to Palm Beach International Airport earlier this afternoon, and the group was showing their appreciation for everything those veterans did during World War II to defeat the Nazis. U.S. Army Sergeant Ray Glansberg and U.S. Army Air Forces Sergeant Sidney Edson went to Normandy for the D-Day 80th anniversary event. Thanks to the efforts of Southeast Florida Honor Flight, Old Glory Honor Flight, American Airlines, and many community donations. There were also several other World War II veterans from our area at the airport today who were not able to make the trip, but enjoyed seeing each other at the homecoming ceremony at the airport. U.S. Army Air Forces veteran Sidney Edson, who went on the trip, shared his thoughts on the 80th anniversary event, and Army veteran Robert Creco reacted to the outpouring of support today. I came on the trip only for one reason, to make my respects to the guys that really had it tough and, and did the job. And once they secured the beach at a tremendous cost, the war was won, and the Germans knew it. It makes me feel great, you know. And I, I, I'm amazed that all these younger people uh, are, are so affected by what we did. And Southeast Florida Honor Flight organizes four trips for veterans every year. The next one is set for September. Reporting live in West Palm Beach, Steve King, WPBF 25 News.